Hey, Bill, I'm in the mood for a switch up. Mm. I hit the function, hit the rose till I hit up. So, yeah, I leave with tough money as a stick up. She picks a puppy, so tough, I told tough, him I'm a flick up. <sighs> This has been weighing on my mind all night, all day. It's not even all day yet. It's 1040. 1040. Yeah. So what did I say? How did I say it? What did I say? The slap heard around the world. Rockhead versus Big Willie style. What did we learn here? Well, I'm not gonna play the video clips. I think that's just ridiculous. I'm just not gonna do that because one, it doesn't really help to show the clip. Uh, I'm just gonna show one still picture of it because one still picture makes sense. It's all you really need to see is the still. There you go. Uh, there is a picture of it. Slap heard around the world. Look. Um, I don't know how to feel about this, but I do have a comment. No, actually, I do know how to feel about it. That's crap. I know exactly how to feel about this. Look. Um, had it not been for Richard Pryor, there would not be a, Rick, a Chris Rock. Richard Pryor, if you all don't remember him, was the most inappropriate person in the world publicly. He would say some of the most outlandish things ever. Um... But very rarely would he disrespect someone like uh, Chris Rock did last night when it came to Jada. Was he out of line? Yes. 100% he was out of line. Should not have been saying stuff like he did. Completely out of line. If you haven't seen it, Google it. You'll see it. It Yeah, it's just ridiculous. Um, I just don't like seeing two uh, very prominent African-American men uh, result to this kind of stuff in the public eye. It's just not good, guys. Not good. Um, now, Will, in every stretch of the imagination, should he be fighting for his lady's honor? Absolutely, 100%. Inequivocally, yes, you should be, but use your words. Use your words, man. Uh, resorting to physical violence in any shape or stretch of the form of the imagination in today's society, especially black on black, mano y mano, we need to be showing that we can rise above this kind of stuff. I just, sad for me, it breaks my heart to see. So, my feelings overall. Two wrongs don't make any of this right in my brain whatsoever. Shouldn't have been done, shouldn't have been said, should have been retaliated. I feel bad for both of them. My heart bleeds, my heart is hard and sad for this right now. I wish it hadn't happened. I wish I don't have to say something on this. Um, I look to black leaders to say something like this, but I keep forgetting I'm so old now, I gotta start being that guy. <laughs> So share this. It's a lesson to be learned. Fellas, somebody says something about your lady, defend her honor. You don't have to punch somebody, slap somebody, nothing like that. Violence is never the excuse, is never the solution. I understand where it's coming from. And other fellas looking for a laugh, don't make other people the butt of the joke. If you go to a comedy show, absolutely. Front row, hey, you know what? You know what the comedian's gonna be doing? Absolutely, you go to any of Chris Rock's show, you're in for it, because he will come after you. But this was an award show, and, the, and it was not about comedy that night. So, I feel bad about it. It hurts my heart, because I love both of these men very much. They have done a lot of good body of work between the two of them. But guess what? Now there's an asterisk, and that hurts me. So, why did I bring this up? Because I do today's talk with Marty G, and I can't do things unless I talk about stuff today. <laughs> so please share this. 
We'll get through it. I'm going to get over it. I had to talk about it because it's been in my brain and the way I work, if you guys know me well enough, is I can't work if I've got things bogging my brain. So, love you. Hug somebody. Send somebody a message. Do something amazing. But don't slap somebody. Well, unless they ask for it. Don't say, hey, come slap me. Then that's something different. But don't, don't just, don't incite stuff. That's just my two cents. That's all I can give you because I thought I could afford. Love ya! I'm out. See you bye. Came back to the city with my bank account on F. Giving rappers, I know they happy that I left. Hit the south and winter, I just put down my deposit. 82 degrees, I left that jacket.